you might associate the color pink with a variety of things. Maybe you think of pink lemonade or perhaps Barbie dolls, pink flamingos, or even a yummy piece of cotton candy. <laughs> Well, for those who have or know someone who has breast cancer, pink signifies something more significant. Um, like a good walking shoe, it's important we show support for those battling this disease. One organization is doing just that, raising awareness and funds for those currently fighting breast cancer, those who have overcome it, and those that we have lost because of it. Here with us this afternoon to tell us more, Raven Cook, who is PR and Marketing Coordinator, and Andy Hess, who is the Event Coordinator. Ladies, thank you so much. Well, thank you. you. Good to see you. Uh, start off, tell me, what, what is Women Support, Supporting Women? Women Supporting Women is a nonprofit, local, grassroots organization, uh, 501c3, with no national affiliation, so all the money that we raise stays here on the Eastern Shore and goes back to survivors of breast cancer. Nice. We provide a multitude of free services and support to these survivors uh, to try and help them out just as much as they need along their journey. And you have an event coming up, a walk. Can you tell us about that? Yes, we have our annual Walk for Awareness. I believe it's the 23rd annual Walk for Awareness. Um, this year we've decided to take it to the Salisbury Mall here at the center of Salisbury, and it will be held inside so we don't have to worry about the weather. There you yeah, go. So good idea. So everybody's excited about that because we don't have to deal with the hurricane predictions or anything <laughs> like <Right>. that. <laughs> we're still going. Yes, we're still going. <laughs> so, um, yeah, so we'll have it at the mall. Um, registrations are currently open to um, do the walk, and it is um, $25 to register, $5 for a canine if you want to bring your dog, as long as you bring your cleaning supplies with the dog. Right, you right. Walk yeah, the you, go, yep. <laughs> you know, I, I, I want to ask you a question, and, and one of the reasons that I ask you this question is because Lisa and I, after talking to a few people, we've gotten to where we can kind of see in someone when they are passionate about a cause. Why does this mean so much to you? Well, I mean, I think everyone knows somebody who's been affected by breast cancer. It's, you know, one of the most common cancers in the world. Yeah. And with something that affects so many people and so many people can relate amongst a shared pain right. um, or a shared trauma, such as having cancer, it brings people together and it shows, like, you have to do something. You have yeah. to fight for this. You have to fight for these people. And you have to fight, you know, to make their lives better. Mm. And what about you, Andy? Um, like she said, everybody is touched by this one way or another, be it a relative, a friend, you know, an associate. Um, the thing I get out of it the most is I, I see myself having a purpose in life now mm -hmm. by being there, creating an event that people can enjoy as I'm raising funds for our nonprofit yeah. that's been around for 31 years just by us doing fundraisers and donations and sponsorships. So seeing the joy on other people's faces and being able, when they walk through our door needing the help and we can give it to them for free, that just makes my heart happy. Yep. Mm. So uh, you said this year you're walking through the through the mall. Mm -hmm. Have you got other new things that we'll see uh, different from, from the last time? Um, I mean, we'll still have our vendors. They're gonna be lined up through the mall as the walkers go through um, so they can pass the vendors during the walk, before the walk or after the walk. Right. Um, we will do our trophy presentations at the end of the walk. We have some stores that are coming on board with decorating their um, storefronts and also giving discounts. Um, we're still confirming those details to anybody that has a walk t-shirt, we'll be able to do that. Yeah. Wow. So that'll be awesome. nice. Yeah. So what are you, you most excited for this year with the event? With the event, moving it inside to see. <laughs> So I don't have um, to worry about, oh no, you know, yeah. here we go, here comes the rain or the wind and it's just, yeah. it's enclosed and I think we'll have a bigger turnout because yeah. of that. Yeah. Is this going to be a speed walk or people going to be throwing elbows and... <laughs> well, yeah, maybe. If they I want to. If they, they want can. to. Yeah. Or if they want to. Yeah, See, it just got even better. Yes. So how can we sign up? How can we sign up? Uh, you can sign up by um, going to our website, www.womensupportingwomen.org. You can call the WSW office at 410-548-7880, um, or you can give us a visit um, and sign up in person um, on the day of the walk. Nice. All right. Nice. Sounds like a, a wonderful dry time. Yes. <laughs> yes. Comfortable time. Thank yes. you so much, Raven and Andy, for coming in. Thank this you. Afternoon. Thank you. Thank you for having us. Good Thank luck. you. <laughs>